Bows. 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 Yeah, we on Boss Talk 101. Yeah, we gon' talk, we gon' have fun. We be on fire, we be lit lit. It's a unique hustle, big, big shit. Big shit, big shit, big shit. It's a unique hustle, nigga, big shit. Big shit, big shit, big shit. Name another podcast like this. Who gon' bring it to the table? Check it, check it, check it. It's a unique hustle. It's your boy ECO. And I'm Money Mose, by the way, and we create content every damn day. Hey, man. So, you know, man, we got hey, we got my guy here today, man. Check it, man. Mr. Lucha, man. What's going on, man? What up, Playboy? Hey, man. I, I want to, hey, man, I, I definitely want to get in this new music, man. Oh, yeah. You know, uh, uh, just kind of like, you know, I know, you know, most, when Pac was in jail. Yeah. He wrote. Yeah. What did you do? Read. Did you read? Did you write? Yeah, I wrote. Well, is any of the music that you putting out, Mm-mm. you just this you change your nah, old concept? I, write, I was writing on books and shit, and then I also what's the name? Um, I wrote music off in there, but nah, that ain't the music. That ain't fire here. <laughs> That's in there. I might why spring what? some out. You know what I'm saying? Was that practicing or what? It's I don't say like practicing, but it's my diary. Just yeah. like you got a diary. Yeah. That was my diary. What um so so, you 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 think that how, how much the music changed from the time you left to the time you came home? Oh uh, shoot! Cause I remember when I first it was it was it was a uh, big what do you call it uh, Cash Money was bumping when I, I yeah <laughs> never forget that I'm like they talking about cars and everything and when I left you know it was it was something different so yeah nah it was um. I mean, really, it didn't change me because I listened to the same music that I listened to before I left. Okay, now, it's, it's it's more it's more it's more the tempo change. Yeah, tempo and a lot more auto tune. A lot more auto tune. Yeah, a lot more auto tune. It came I, don't, back. I, I I really can't think. Trying to name a rapper, Mozzie. I, I jam Mozzie like a mug, so I'm just trying to name a couple of rappers that I can name who don't got auto tune on their voice, and it's so you don't like that auto tune. I just you I didn't say that. that you can't I, rock I, with I, it. I didn't say that. I just said I ain't doing auto tune, and I say that you asked me what I see the difference. Yeah, right now auto tune. Auto tune. Yeah. Um. So yeah, cause cause one thing I can say, uh, you, I can say you got a distinct voice, man. Yeah. Everybody, and it for me it was always about the voices. To me, you know, like certain artists, the voice, the way they cadence is, mm-hmm. that stands out, and it, it it would be the same for you too. You know, being that you a rapper, you know, you've I'm rapped. Rapper. Well, you rapped I'm in not, Vegas when we was out there. I am that not That nigga gonna try to rapper. rap. That nigga was up there. I had I a beat. I am not a rapper. What, what he go by? Nothing. That, nigga, know, had a, that nigga had a beat. He had a song called uh, something by Trump. What was the song? Oh, Ballin' with Trump. Ballin' with Trump. Trump started sending that money. That nigga started rapping. You know what I'm talking about? Okay. <laughs> it wasn't even that. I just made the song because I was. Just, I like I like writing songs. So I heard that song. I, I mean, I, I heard that beat. And I'm like, damn. Trump just started sending money out. And my little brother called me. He was like, hey, I just got my $1,200. So you got your money? I said, nah, I ain't got it because I ain't getting 12. I yeah. knew I wasn't getting 12. <laughs> yeah. So when you heard it, I was like, damn, everybody started calling. I'm, I'm, I'm balling with Trump. Somebody said on Facebook, I'm balling with Trump. I said, I'm going to make a song called Balling with Trump. Yeah. And it's really, it's really not balling with Trump. It's not balling. With Trump, it's, it, I mean, it's not balling for Trump. It's balling with him. Like, yeah, he all giving us money, so we all getting money. So he's balling. Yeah, let me. I, so, I so yeah. So when you when you came home, you know, you you how was the studio? It was like you never left when you went. And did nah. It, yeah, I keep. My, I'm, I'm 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 when I got in there, I'm doing shows. I'm performing and I'm doing that in jail. Really, perform with a lot of band and all that type of stuff. Yeah, that's hot. So. I'm writing music for the these le- years. You got to be able to perform it all the way through. Wow. So you don't write it where you cut and paste. So when I got off in there, I'm, I'm writing, I'm, I'm, I'm rapping, because that's what I did when I first came home. I, I rapped some of the stuff that I had just to get used to the booth. And it was hard because rapping the verse and then coming back, doing the chorus on another track, it was like man, it was it just it, it was just it was just I had to get back used to it. Yeah, I had yeah. To get back used to it. I ain't yeah. gonna lie. Okay, I okay. Park. So the first, so even when I did that certified, when I came out, I, I remember that was a year. That was almost nine, ten months ago, and I was like, why did he do that certified? And then that's the name of the album too, right? No. Nah, What's the name, the name of the album? album? Diamond in the Rough. Diamond in the Rough. Yeah. Okay, so because at first I'm like, did he do certified? And then he gonna name his whole project that? Because nah. I was looking back. That's why I called you. I was like, send me a couple of songs or something I could. 
See yeah. what's going on. Nah, nah, nah. I just did certified. That was hot though. I like certified, bro. But if you listen to it, it was the same way I rapped it. I, I, it's, it's just one take. Okay. All the way through. Yeah. So it's no pause. One take all the way through. So, but now, um, I'm, 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 I'm in my bag right now. So, yeah. Yeah. So yeah. I'm, so you, you got it now. Yeah, I'm having fun. I just <laughs> had it. It's just like riding a bike. You just had to get back used what? to it. So had your son been in the studio? While I was gone? Yeah. Nah, he hadn't been okay. in the studio while I was okay. gone. Okay, so you started. Wasn't nobody to take him. You know, okay. It wasn't like that. Because you know, my brother, when I, like, right when I went to jail, my brother had moved to Florida. Oh, with work. Yeah, yeah. He ended up yeah. moving to Florida. So, and he didn't come. He's still in Florida right now. He just came home this week for, okay. uh, for, for the Man. release party. But, listening party. But I nah, seen that. Wasn't nobody there. So you guys had that listening party. It looked crunk too, uh, and man, Mama was, was there too. It was loud. Yeah, my baby showed yeah, up. Yeah, man. I baby say, oh up. yeah, yeah, baby was out there. That's my guy right there. Yeah, I yeah. ain't got him on the show yet, but I'm working on him. I'll oh, be tracking right. him down. I'm gonna I get already. him. I ain't tripping. Yeah, we he, can make but, it happen. Yeah, the thing I say is, man, um, is is when y'all was out there, the, it seemed like the crowd and the energy was right. Yeah, it really threw me for a loop because you know when you first let people hear music for the first time. I ain't never heard it before. I was shocked at some of the reactions that I was getting. So I'm like, yeah, that's a good one. That's I like, I, 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 I listened. I was trying to catch it. I was like, nah, I got to call him. I got to get me some. I yeah. got to text him, get me some so I can bang out so I can get it, you yeah, know? Yeah, yeah. And I love it, man. Like I said, the the, the one song, the uh, I, I want to listen to a little bit of it. I think it was Oh Nobody. That's the one right there. Because I can relate to it. Yeah. 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 Man, hopefully it's a whole lot of stuff. Dude, I, can I can relate to that, Trust bro. Me. You hear me? What I tell you I was gonna do when I got out of jail. Yeah. yeah. Got these niggas in their bodies right now. Fuck. Hey, I don't know nobody nothing. I don't know nobody nothing. Now I don't want nobody nothing. Now I don't know no nigga nothing. Hey, when nobody there to help. Nah. When them people pick me up. Hey, man, I took that by myself. I, by I ain't myself. took nobody else. So yeah. I don't know nobody nothing. I don't know Just check it out right here. Like I, yeah. I want to hear that, that first part. Jump back out and got back on, and I won't pick up my phone. I don't know you. Hey, what was you thinking when I was gone? Hey, what was you doing when I was gone? Was doing, hey, how was you eating when I was gone? Now be the same nigga, not that I'm home. Yeah, people be reaching out, they ain't reaching back. Real shit. They weren't thinking about me when I was Oh, you ain't gotta ask what that means. Don't feel that first line. There's something wrong with them. Yeah, 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 yeah. No, no, it's just really, it's prophetic. You just speaking truth. Yeah. You know what I mean, and you don't know nobody. Hey, but the truth hurt though. It 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 it'll it'll crank some no, things the truth up. Hurt. You know what I'm yeah, saying? It, it will. It, it will crank People some things up. Lie to them tell the truth. It it hurts when they they don't want to face it. Yeah, that too. That's when it hurts. I was trying to say I was gonna like, well, what inspired that song? Hell, I ain't got to ask you that. You I don't. don't. <laughs> Cause you already know what inspired it. Everybody bro, know what inspired. I like it though. They left me alone off in that cell, bro. Yeah, yeah. They left me alone. Everybody that I heard. For, they left me alone in that cell. Bro. I've been there. So it's it, cool. it changes things. I don't, yeah, I don't hate nobody. No, no, no. It just I, wake I, you I, up. Yeah, wake me you up. You know, I, I never forget it. I put trust no one but God on my back. Yeah. Because it, it, it make you feel that way. Yeah. You know, <laughs> just being yeah. real, man. Straight up. So, you know, um, that song is, that's, 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 I, I, so who who produced that? Uh, Bruce Banner. Bruce Banner? Okay, yep. okay. Did he do any more tracks on the album? Mm -hmm. Nah, he just did that one. Okay, okay. That's what's up. Had you linked with him before? Or? Yeah, I knew him before I went to jail. Okay. Yeah. I, I want, I, I'm going to go back before jail just one little bit because I thought about that movie, Triple D. Was it Triple yep. D? Yeah, it was a Triple D. And and you was in that before you left. Uh-huh. That's where they picked me up at. Really? Yeah. I, I, I didn't know movie, that. the movie premiere. Yeah, that's what, they, that's what the feds picked me up. They stayed, watched the movie and everything. Are waited, you serious? Yeah, waited for me to go outside and they grabbed me. Wow. With nobody else around, yep. Wow. That's crazy, but I mean, man, life just happens, bro. And 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 you could you could need it, you need to write a book. I already have. You I is it out? Is it published or self published? Nah, or you had to publish it? Not yet. I'm okay. gonna start doing gonna I, I, I want to get this music popping first to yeah. where I have a bigger platform Time when is I release. Everything. When you bring that book back, man, yeah. we gotta do it again right here. Yeah. I done had a I bought three, four books, about four books to come through. I read it. I love to do that too. I yeah. ain't gonna do an autobiography yet though. Okay. Nah, cause it's 
That's deep, though. It's too many chapters to get Yeah, on. but it's deep, bro. Yeah, it's going to be right when it's done. Yeah, yeah. This ain't the end, though. This ain't near the end. So and an- another thing I'm going to drop back to because I forgot a while ago was, I, you know, when I was selling them Algiers uh, Crook for Life TV yeah. t-shirt, was you getting any of that money or what? Or did did well, Dan take care of you? Because that Dan Algiers, that's my guy. Yeah, nah, it wasn't. I don't... Um, just for quick... Uh, that was a brief second. Yeah, I'm just yeah, asking yeah, you a yeah, question yeah, now. Yeah, 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 yeah. Everything was cool. Dan... My partner owned the Algiers shop. He the one that brought Dan down here. The On Walnut. Company. Yeah, you know what I'm saying? That's I know what, exactly what you're talking yeah, about. Yeah, that was, that, was, that was my plug. He, you know, so that's, I was took care of. You yeah. Know what I'm saying? I, I sold a lot of those shirts, man. A lot of them over the years. You got to realize I've been setting clothes a long time. So yeah. I thought about y'all when I was, I said, damn, my boy's right there. Yeah. You know, so I had to grab me some of them. Dan, get me some of them. I got to have them because I'm in Dallas, man. And uh, you know what I'm saying? Texas, we love them, them boys, man. Yeah. And, and that's how they went. It was a red one and a blue one. I'll never forget it. Yeah. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Crook for life with the black, with the crook, with the little mad stop man on yeah. it. Yeah. Uh, good times, man. Uh, so well, now we can move back forward. I had to drop back. Now. No, you good. <laughs> I'm just you thinking good. about a couple of things, man. Yeah, so good. what you got for him? Uh, do you have a favorite studio you like to go to? I got a favorite, favorite studio. Favorite studio, yeah. That you just go to, or you always want to go to? Man, nah, I can't say because the vibes be different inside of it. That's why I asked the question. Yeah, I can't say because, you know, right now, if the right beat come on at the right time, it's going to be my favorite studio for right now. Damn. So So I just go with with, where the music at because I do like intimate small studios because we recorded all our stuff in the closet. The the Diabolic and the Ripple, we did that in the one-bedroom apartment in the closet. So yeah. I'm used to that. So when you go into the – when I do go in the big studios, like I did a jam with a live band on this album, y'all going to hear, you know what I'm saying, mm-hmm. called Wings. Uh, I brought a live band in. So when we did that song, it's in a big studio. You know, it's fun. It feels good, you know. But still, I like, you know, I like going back into the the the, 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 the more cold So do you like a lot spots. of people in the studio with you? Or you just like just you or uh, a couple people? I don't care who it is. I zone out. Yeah. I zone out. You know, I zone out. I just turn the beat on. Now, what I don't want in the studio is, hey, man, uh, can I get a picture? Hey, man, uh, uh, trying to talk to me about something. Nah, because nah. you're working, really. You're yeah, working now. Yeah, working. And see, people, I got to keep in mind, people don't be understanding. See, I don't write on paper. I go in the corner or I walk. Like, right now, I could be writing. Yeah. You know, while we sitting there talking or if be playing or I'm doing something, I be writing. So, people would think I'm just chilling. So they don't want to come talk to me, but I ain't chilling. I'm writing, and you throwing me off, homie. Just, just don't let me <laughs> catch my it. rhythm. You know, yeah, don't let yeah, me lose my yeah, rhythm. Yeah. They, you have some, you have a, 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 a nice little section, and then they come say something to you, and they throw they you off. And by off. the time you get back, you lose yeah, the you rhythm. You lose the words and all that. I know exactly. I did so. this morning. <laughs> That's crazy. I did same thing. Told you he was a rapper. It was like sick this morning. I, I, I told you he was a rapper. I wasn't even right. I was just listening to a beat. Yeah, yeah. I told you that nigga rap. My phone that nigga rapper. rapper. My phone room. Say, I got, I'm not a rapper. I just you, like writing. No, you're a rapper, nigga. And if somebody no, wants a song, no, I say, hey, no, you're a rapper. That nigga yeah. rapper, dog. And he I'm be writing for people, too. So he all the way in there, nigga. Yeah. This is a nigga is a rapper and a writer. Right. Yeah, it's two different things going on. I'm a writer. I don't write. I'm, I don't rap. Th- Oh, you like quit rapping. Rap. Yeah. You retired. I don't like They call it, it retirement. I don't like I never did it. <laughs> I ain't made no money from it. <laughs> yeah. I was like a little kid trying to play football, and he didn't like it, so he stopped. Let me ask you this, man. Top three artists of all times, man. Everybody, we ask the same question. Top three. All time? All time. Dead or alive. Any genre. Oh, I do it every time. And everybody said, man, you didn't all give me that hell of a like, dang. All right. Top I'm three. Gonna get, I'm going to give. Um, Number one. You got to get Pac in there, man. He's still it, dropping. I so you're number he one? You know. That's good, ain't it? <laughs> you just said top three. You didn't have to say it. No, no, no. Just, just top, three. top three. So top I'm, three. He in there. Okay. I'm going to throw, um, throw DMX in there. DMX. You know, and shoot. um. It's crazy, man, because I kind of, you know, I'm naming that right there, but, you know, honestly, with my roots and stuff, you know, you can't do a top list without face-off in it. Okay. And then. Three is all we need. Yeah. So we got we got Pac, we got DMX, we got Scarface, which is nice. I love it. You know what I mean? Yeah. Um, You know, um, and thinking of, because every time I ask somebody the top three and I look at you, 
I yeah. think about your top three, nigga. Mine's gonna, top mine's gonna, gonna always be me. Yeah, it, Mo Lil, three, Lil, Lil, uh, Lil Boosie, oh, no. and uh, Mo three, Mo three, Lil Uzi, and I ain't no Lil Uzi enough. <laughs> I don't put nah, that enough. Lil Webby and uh, Lil, uh and Boosie. That's his yeah. three. But he's from Louisiana. And um speaking of Mo Three, uh you and him had a relationship. Yeah, that's my rest, um, rest, rest in peace. Rest Mo in three, peace, man. Mo Three. Um so were you out when that happened? You was home. Yeah, I was home, man. And and you were you out when they first started wearing the mask or you was just yeah, I was, no, that's when I got out of jail. I got out on Martin Ninth City Lockdown on the eighteenth. Whoa. So Damn. and then it stayed like that. Y'all already know until so, I'm fresh out the halfway house and now I got to stay here. So it's that's like, crazy. I'm still locked up. That's crazy. You know what I mean? That's crazy. But it happens. Yeah, but, it happens. Happens. It's cool. It's cool. But, but let, let, let's get into Mo Three a little bit more because that hold your tongue when he redone that. Yeah. Um, did he come to you get your blessings on it or how did that hold? Because you was now, in the video, wasn't you? Yeah, I was in the yeah. I, I fought with Three. You know okay. what I'm saying? But Three used to mess with my little nephew, Big Dun Dun. Okay. So, um, I've been hearing about him, but I didn't. I hadn't got to link up with him yet. Okay. And then I ended up being in the studio with my uh, partner, Spliff Wayne. And Spliff was like, "Bro, here, listen to this. He produced because he produced the beat. So I listen to that thing. I'm like, "Ooh, that boy hard, you know." So I come back to the north. That's when I go meet him and stuff. Wow. Like, yeah, I got that shit, fam. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. So show them love. Been, been linked ever since. Wow. Yeah. Yeah, I, I think Chief was in the in the video as well. Wasn't Man, Chief, no, he ain't sh he ain't. he ain't show up. No, well, he wasn't in the video, fam. He was in the dude took. They edit, took some visual. They took edit footage from something else and put okay. it. Okay, you know? okay, but not nah, because it did look weird, kind of different. Yeah, it sure did. But you was <laughs> in it actually. Yeah, I was on that pavement. Okay, that's what's up, man. I, I just like the fact that you got to. Now it's special because you got to do that with him. Yeah, and that's a part of his legacy. Short lived, do you know what I mean? Yeah. So Too that short. that yeah that that that's special. Yeah. Um, Y'all ain't never planning to do a song together. Yeah. Yep. We was from we was from the door right now. If I open my phone, the text messages last. The text messages send me your email. Wow. Send my email. You know what I'm saying? Wow. So it's like, you know what I mean? But he I've was my there. partner when I came home. Though you know he was my he you know he my partner he my partner you know yellow my partner when I before yeah. I went to jail they both. We was at the same studio, they because they both came and got on my album. Wow. So we in the studio together. So when I leave, everything was straight. Everything, everything was straight. Was straight. So when I you come, come back, home, it's all it's, it's all just, crazy yeah. jacked up. So when it first came home, I went and talked to both of them, and basically told them what I felt. You know, I, my whole mo mo was like, "Get out, man! Try to squash it." You yeah, know, yeah, squash of course, it. of course, of course. But then I get out and I find out it's a lot that more it's deeper it. than what Definitely. I think. And and both of them, you know, I I talked to both of them. We had personal conversations, and I did express myself at the end of the day. Once they told me what it was, and I realized, I say, okay, that's what's up, fam. But you know, I gotta tell you, you know, I got love for both of y'all, man. You know what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. I just hate the situation, fam. I love that, man. So, bro, you a real stomp down dude to do that. And yeah. I, I I remember I stood right in here, and when I went viral, almost uh, hundred some thousand views, uh, talking about uh, when. Yo Gotti and, and Dolph was doing that. And I was like, where the OGs at? Why ain't nobody stepping up? And then it was a lot of niggas that got in their comments, they were mad at me, but I just spoke my piece. Real niggas, you know, I, that been locked up and then been through stuff. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, but see, that's what, what that's what it is. We, we gotta speak, say something, man. We can say something, but we can't stop something sometimes. We can't stop something, you know? but we can at least say something. Yeah, you gotta do your part, that's yeah, your part. And you that's the part something. I'm commending yeah, in yeah, you. Yeah, I, I had to say something, I yeah. had to say something. Yeah, I ain't saying you did anything, you changed the narrative you know I mean? or not, but you still said something. So, you know, I still, you know, you know what I'm saying, and even after, you know, you're still going on, you know, I still support both of them, you know. Yeah, yeah. I hate the situation, but yeah. I, I haven't lost love for neither one of them. I, I'd listen to both of them, like I said, I love, I like Yellow, <laughs> that was my thing, Yellow was my guy, and it's kind of funny, Mo3 was his guy, so we kind of, that's something we talk about a lot, and then you know, um, cause of the way the music, not nothing to do with the beef, but I just like the, I, I just felt like he was like you, you more marketable to me than a lot of people. You gotta yeah. have a look, you know what I mean? And yeah. you had a look to me. I, it'd be the same way. I pick people over business. I'm a business dude. You yeah, know what nah, I mean? I understand. What so you're that's saying. that's where I come from. Mine, he, like, man, the lyrics deep and that. so we, we both looking at it from do two different ways but we both got our rights and i can say i grew to like mo3 as his music it got better for me he yeah. got better and better and better yeah, and, 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 and 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 he the beef thing just kept 
worrying me though, because from the early on part of he having issues with other people, I was fighting on Facebook one time. I remember, and then it was another thing where. I think he had a run in with one of the dudes to do the mixtapes or whatever. But I was like looking at those things too. But I'm looking at dollars. I'm like, okay, yeah, but did, but yeah, this, he looked like he's staying over here. So it's 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 a money thing, you know what I mean, for a business dude when he look at it versus a guy who like that nigga real, fan. that nigga hard, yeah, you know. Yeah, yeah. That's the way it yeah. be. Um, but you you pretty quiet today. I'm I'm liking that. You didn't say nothing back or nothing, and I appreciate you. Cause I don't want to go nowhere. It shouldn't go. <laughs> okay. Why, why would it? I don't. No, I don't it, it ain't right going now. nowhere. We just no, I'm talking. not saying uh, with us. I'm just saying just yeah. in general, straight up. Yeah. Like you're saying, like you saying both of them was cool. Like you saying, he was always marketable. Yellow was always. Yeah, marketable. that's what I say. But Mo Three just speaking some real shit. Yeah. 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 Talent wise, I mean, yeah. I'm Mo Three. Talent wise, he, he, lyrical, he, 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 lyrical. Yeah. yeah. Mo Three. Like, no, can't nobody. No. Mo Three might be the best. To do it, yeah. like say lyrical, yeah, you yeah, got. He is. He, yeah, he, he is. He, he had his time. He he's, he's the best in Texas. You know what I'm saying? Well, he, he won, won up. He no, won up. I ain't for to say that, bro. He's the best in Texas. I ain't for to say that, bro. Don't do that, bro. No, listen, what I'm saying. Yeah, I'm, I best, got Mr. Lucha sitting in here, nigga. You crazy, nigga? Rap, yeah, sing, nigga. Don't play with me, nigga. Rap, sing, and do. Now that's how we do it. In one song, like you know, you don't see rappers doing like singing, singing. They rapping and they they telling all telling stories at one time. Why you doing? I mean. No, you don't that's see cool, like but that's that's you your preference. Pre- Remember, that's your opinion, though. It's a my opinion. Okay, now you know what I'm no saying. Way. I mean, I might want to hear some lyrics and hear some cadences just dropping a certain way on a certain beat, and I feel like can't nothing touch that. That's my preference. Yeah. So right. it's all about we your all ear, to what we right? Because I'm a, I'm, I get it. Because I'm a Pimp C fan. Yeah. So you yeah. know what I mean. I, yeah. I, the way he done, because he produced beats, I could say that. Yeah. And not only did he produce beat, he did those hooks and song, and then he also pretty much had a hell of a rhyme Fucking scheme. Right. So yeah, you did. can't. Nah, so did. that's a whole nother level too. Yeah. Now that's what? <laughs> Y'all grew up on him, so I can't say that. Well, you can go back and yeah, you can always what? go back and check. Yeah. yeah if if I go back, it ain't gonna change. It ain't gonna change. Different time, ain't it? That's why I say Boosie and Webb because I grew up on them. They had all types of songs you can listen to. Yeah, but they want no PMC. It, it wasn't for me. <laughs> I said, if I ain't here, it wasn't for me. I get it. I get it. So let me let's get back to you. The music, straight truth. I yeah. want to listen at that. Let me, let me vibe out to it for a second so I can see what process you took when you are. Uh... Yeah, yeah, huh? Hey, Blue diamond, cool. nigga. You like that one? Yeah. Stank it was. Huh? Hey, look, niggas turn they back cause they can't face you, that's a statement. And niggas only rat cause they can't take it, that's the basis. And niggas only hate you cause they ain't you. And everything you stand for, they can't do. And nigga, that's the straight truth. Now everybody wanna see you on until you make it. And then they praying for your downfall cause they can't take it. In the end, only a handful of people that's gonna stay true. They take it from me, homie, that's yeah. the straight truth. Huh. Hey, yeah. look, I do it for my niggas in the feds, in the state too. I do it for the ones who kept it silent. How we Stay true, these niggas wanna see me boxed in, they want me to break loose. But shit, I'm slapping shit up out the park, just like I'm Beirut. These niggas walking around this whole war, like in Beirut. These rappers. Man, how long did it take you to write that, man? Shit, probably about an hour or two, something like that. Ooh, I that's just, fire, I, man. Yeah, I, can, I love the way you rhyming right on up. that, man. You can tell, that one came out, he got out of jail. You can tell. Oh, I mean, that boy talking, feelings, man. You know, it's feelings, you can feel his feelings. You can feel it. You gotta feel it. Yeah, I mean, I, I, that, that's, I really, to it. that's what I. My whole purpose of this project, like I say, man, I ain't trying to make nothing for the club. I ain't trying to make nothing for such. such. I just want you to feel me. You know, if you go to the club, you can that's go to cool. the club. But I'm just saying, I just want you to feel me, man. Put the put this in in the deck and I ride. I ride to that one now. Man, you killed that, bro. That's where I'm at. You killed that, bro. Like I said, I love what, what you're doing with it, and, and it comes out on the 21st. Yeah, April 21st, next Wednesday, man. Say, man. Next you Wednesday. Gotta get that. Got cop that. Hey, and this is the I'm gonna 20th jam it out year on anniversary. There. This is my 20th year anniversary when I dropped Diabolical. I dropped, that's really? why I'm dropping it on this day. So, wow. So, 20 years ago, I dropped Diabolical. Now, I'm finna drop Diamond in the Rough. What's the name of the one with your son on? I'm, I'm gonna go. I'm it's gonna called Outchill. Yeah, yeah, I'm gonna I'm jam that one. Yeah, now nah, you gonna jam with mom, man. No, 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 no. I just want to hear y'all, man. You know, you you I want to hear, hear y'all, trust bro. Me, you gonna hear it. I'm gonna jam with mom. You got you it. right about that, but I, I just want to. I, I want to. I know you working with it, man, and it's a beautiful thing, man. It's your yeah. son, bro. It's just something that because a lot of people they do it. Uh, I mean, uh, Will and uh, Jaden did it. Uh, yeah. Who else? Who else? Son and father. Uh, Ice Cube and his son. Got his son doing. He did. See, my little boy, that's really what he want. He, he want to act? He, that's, you know, he go to school and do the acting and all okay, that type okay. of stuff, you know. So that's really acting and modeling. So I'm like, well, look, we just going to use this platform 
while you do it and yeah. then you go do what you really want to do i mean if you want to stay here and do this then you know you can always get some bread right here that, yeah you know jamie fox wanted to sing and he ended up acting first yep. so it's stuff like that you never know what avenue is going to happen to transpire so what would what would mr what would lou diamond say to mr lucci at 18 when he signed that contract or when he dealt with that that new new deal or whatnot what would you say to what would you say lou diamond would say to mr lucci uh, you feel me i hope you're ready for it oh that would just say yeah, to him i hope you're ready for what you just did wow because while i'm sitting here talking to y'all thinking like uh, you know like i was saying i was wrong i messed up and stuff. yeah man if i wouldn't have did it i wouldn't be where i'm sitting wow. today amen so all that was meant yeah you know yeah. it's written emotionally yeah, yeah i feel wrong but God's way, it went the way it was supposed to go because mm -hmm. he don't make mistakes. That's so real. I, I be I feeling like that too. I be calling your brother every time it happened. I oh like, yeah, man, this happened for a reason. I, yeah. I call him one day and I said something happened. I hear like, what you mean? I said I don't know, but something just happened to me and something happened. And I called him back like an hour later and said this happened because that happened. Wow. Yeah, yeah. it be like that. So you, you know, it's it's like a counter effect, you know. And 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 you're right. And a lot of people ask you like. If you had to do all over again, would you do it the same way? Sure will. See, and that, and, and that you would end up doing the time and everything. Yeah, got to. See what you I mean? Because it made you the man you are today. Bro, I wouldn't have my kids. I Damn. wouldn't have. I mean, it, just, that's real. Got to. That's real. I do exactly. That's the real. Same. That's real, man. I just, I just like the way that that you know that that you, you the, the questions we've asked you, the things that you've said, man. Like I said, some some kid out there, if it's a guy that's trying to rap, that that's trying to get in the rap game. Uh, what would you what what would you tell him? Focus on what you got going on, and you can't take everybody with you. When you moving, you got to be places. Get there. Okay. The reason I always be by myself when everybody see me, they gonna see me moving by myself is because I got friends and family who I like. Mm -hmm. But at the same time, when it's business, I ain't got time to go over here. And, I didn't did it before. I like I know I got to be there at seven thirty, bro. I tell you, I'm I be there. At, 645 I get there wow. you gotta oh I, let me let me put my shirt on let me wait for my girl to come back from the store now it's 745 and we just not leaving wow. and I don't know I'm 15 minutes late on wow. something so it's like you can't have emotions when you're dealing with this treat this as yeah. a business yeah. if you if you're trying to do it treat it as a business yeah treat it just like you go to work wow. treat it as a business respect it and it's gonna respect you wow otherwise if you just want to rap for your homeboys and do that in the room just get you a job and keep working and just do that when you when you that's know good on stuff. your free time that's good stuff thank you so much man anything else you want to tell your fans before we leave uh, uh hey i appreciate y'all riding with me for all these years it's been 23 years since i done touched that microphone and y'all done been with me every day since then and y'all will continue to be with me so april 21st diamond in the rough diamond music group that's my label. Y'all be on the lookout for my new artist, 265. I got a new artist named 65 too, man. So shout out Eddie B, my producers, my brother, Doski G, Time Capture Film. We we, we, we we in here. Stack Mode. Shout out my boy Stack Mode. You need to get my boy Mooney 900 up in here on the interview, too. Okay. Straight up. All you gotta do, okay, all you got to yeah. do is, um, like I said, you, you, you got my hotline now. I'm from the link. Anytime you, you know, if, if it's somebody, you, I mean, I respect you, man. Yeah. Shout out yeah. Mooney 900. Y'all go get his album, COVID, COVID 900. I'm on my way to this really, uh, to a show right now. Yeah, it's you got it tonight. It came yeah, out, yeah. Tonight. Well, I'm finna, I just, I'm finna go to this show I, right I now. Just, I just, I just. have a video shoot the other night. Yeah, I had a video shoot the well, other night. One thing I can say. See, this boy right here, oh, he, 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 he linked in. But that's the reason he's here. He's yeah. the street. I don't go nowhere. I gotta <laughs> have somebody linked in. And yeah, this guy up. tell me yeah, I can call him. Too. I hit yeah, him he gonna know. I hit him up like when I first started rapping. I hit him up. He like come to the studio right now. But I didn't have the car to go get there. Go wow, that's, that's my guy, up. man. Like, yeah, like my little brother. Well, like, like he's just family. You know, we that's just we try to link up to make sure we get the right information to try to get somebody some help through these microphones. You know what I mean? Get yeah. everybody linked in. And I think it's, it, like I said, I know it's doing this thing, man. God is good. And I appreciate you for coming on the show, man. You always welcome back. And I respect what you've done so far. And I know you're going to do greater and bigger things. Yeah. We wish you much success. We love you. We want to see you win. That's what it is. Appreciate that, Say, man. man. Vice versa. Check it, man. Boss Talk 101. Boss Talk 101. Boss Talk 101.